Puas berwisata biasanya perut jadi lapar. Mau beli malas, mau memasak tapi bingung bagaimana mengolah bahan-bahannya. Jangan khawatir, kami hadirkan sajian istimewa Nia Jawa Tengah untuk Anda. Tanya dong, Sef. Hello and welcome to the Chris Kitchen. I take you to the journey of the most happening and experiencing food preparation. Simple yet exciting to enjoy. Okay, so let's go with the Twitter. What does the Twitter say? Hi Chef. Sekarang lagi booming nih tahu bulat. Tanya ya chef, selain dibikin kayak gini, tahu itu bisa dibikin apa lagi sih? Kayak temen nongkrong atau cemilan? Tanya ya chef. Oke, okay, the trending and the Twitter today is all about tofu. Wow, what an exciting thing to experiment with. Very easy, very simple, easily available at any place, at your home, at your supermarket. So today I am going to take you to a journey of a very simple dish of a tofu. This is coming from the land of Thailand. Very simple, very easy to make and these are the small things or ingredients which you need to finish it. So let's start. Are we all ready? We're talking about tofu today. The dish which I am going to prepare is called tahu tot. Tahu is tofu in Thailand and tot means fried. So in a simple, it's a fried tofu. Now what is going to make it more interesting is the sauce. So we start with the first thing first. What you need is chili, you need some garlic, so we start with the chili. Now these chilies are, you know, these chilies are not very hot, not very spicy, but very, gives you a very delicate flavor with the spiciness. We're gonna add all this thing to a blender. And then I'm gonna add some tamarind. I'm gonna add some water to it to allow it to blend. Okay, it's done. It's very important that we place and check the consistency of the puri because this we are going to boil it again. What we are going to add to it is some sugar and salt. And we also use some palm sugar here. The reason I add a palm sugar, it gives you a very nice caramel flavor to the sauce. Now till the time it's boiling, we'll go to the next step, which is our tofu. We just have to slice it and cut it into a triangle. Now since our tofu is ready, what we are going to do is we'll work on our vegetables, which is going with the tofu. We go for the bell pepper again and then you can easily remove the stem and the seed like this. Now you can see the sauce is almost getting ready. We'll add a little bit of soya sauce to it just to give you that tingy taste of soya. We will remove it from the fire and let it cool down. Because after it cooled down, we are going to add some peanut and cilantro to it. 
We're gonna cook the vegetable first and then we go to tofu. Now vegetable, we just want to keep it very simple and crunchy. We'll add a little bit of oil. Remember, we also have to add soya sauce, so make sure that we don't add too much salt, just a little. We go with the bean sprout to finish it. So we'll take the vegetable out. So we start with the tofu, we need to fry the tofu. The oil is ready, we just have to pop in the tofu here. We'll make it a nice golden brown color, it's still getting the color. We take out the tofu. This is what we wanted, not too dark, not too light. Now we have the tofu ready. We just make a slit inside, in the center. So just make a slit like this, so it can open up like a pocket. So we open the pocket, we can put the vegetable inside, not too much, so it's not very stuffing. Now the thing which is left is the sauce. We go for the sauce. So you can have the feel of the peanut. We take the cilantro, we just need to chop it and mix it together so it gives you a nice place it in a sauce bowl okay so now we have nice chili sauce and we have the tofu let's try it out we top it little with the sauce take a bite i'm dying to have this this is one of my favorite End this bang up.